Since the moment President Donald Trump parked warships outside North Korea last month in a show of force, he's been playing little Kim Jong-un like the puppet he is. The North Korean leader acts tough with his marching army theatrics and taunting announcements of more weapons testing. However, now he seemingly runs scared into hiding after what the USS Truman was just caught doing after his threatened to sink one of our other aircraft carriers the USS Carl Vinson with a single strike. Kim has been all talk and only a humiliating show of force with his floppy weapons and failed launches. In the tug of war of power between him and Trump, he's getting pulled down fast as his game of looking big is proving just how small and incompetent he really is. However, he's recently gone strangely silent in the past couple of days and likely hiding in fear for his life, after panicking about what the USS Truman just did that sent one of the biggest messages to this little dictator, yet. The USS Harry S. Truman that is part of the same class of aircraft carriers, the Nimitz class, as the Vinson which is important based on what is seen in footage that was just obtained from the Ultimate Military Channel. The Truman, which is the same size and has the same capabilities as the Vinson parked outside North Korea, pulls a quick, yet impressive stunt, in this footage which could be devastating for the country if and when the Vinson decides to do it too and shut Kim Jong-un up for good and our military is more than ready and willing to do it when the dictator least expects it while thinking he's safe in his hiding spot. The massive rig makes a sharp right turn on a dime, which is a pretty impressive skill for a ship this size, but not nearly as much as the effect it causes when traveling at a high speed, which the Truman was in this video. Witnessing the incredible power and stress put on the ship and what it can do can should it be given orders to is the difference between America's military power and North Korea's which is merely a set up props put in place to look tough but can do no damage. According to the accompanying caption, this extraordinarily rare vision of an aircraft carrier conducting this type of action was captured during sea trials to train sailors and to ensure the operational capability of systems and equipment, Tactical Clips reports. This isn't the only aircraft carrier of its kind at America's disposal. We have a total of nine others that can do major damage to North Korea and their amateur munitions. They picked the wrong country to mess with and made it worse for themselves when they didn't back down to our real show of force that their fake one is no match for. Instead, Kim Jong-un is looking for a clean pair of pants after seeing what this bad boy is warming up to do to his silly little country. It's doubtful that Kim has any more tough talking to do about the Vincent and his plans to take this Goliath out. Tactical Clips continues with more damning details about this massive rig that North Korea can't touch. The Nimitz-class supercarriers are a category of 10 nuclear-powered aircraft carriers actively serving in the United States Navy. The lead ship of the fleet is named after the World War II U.S. Pacific Fleet Commander, Admiral Chester Nimitz, the Navy's last fleet admiral. If only Kim's bark was as big as he'd bite he might be taken seriously but his mouth is writing checks that his backside can't cash. Not that he cares, but his ego and apparent mental illness is putting every life on his island in danger for what's coming their way if he doesn't back down. Every action he takes is a provocation of war and he's only fortunate that America has restrained this long, but his luck is about to run out. Kim Jong-un can run and hide but he'll have to resurface sometime and when he does, it better be with him waving a white flag. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment because we want to hear your voice and thank you for watching.